Michael Cahill Bed and Breakfast, located in Ashtabula, Ohio, is one of the most beautifully decorated and cared for homes in which we've stayed. Situated on top of a scenic hill in the historic Ashtabula Harbor, this majestic home was built in 1887 by Michael Cahill, an emigrant from Ireland who became a prosperous innkeeper. The covered porches are a favorite resting place for visitors to have a cool drink or enjoy a morning coffee while seated in a cushion chair or rocking chair. Now, let's meet the innkeepers, Joanne and Bob Cervella, and take a tour of their home. Welcome to the Michael K. Hill Bed and Breakfast, and welcome to Ashtabula. Inside, you will enjoy a variety of tasteful and creatively placed antique and Victorian period decor, paired with the modern comforts of central air conditioning and Wi-Fi. Hanging in the front parlor is a portrait of Signa Emily Dallin, the daughter of the family who was the second owner of this home. Beneath the portrait sits her personal Bible. Opposite of the parlor is another covered porch, which opens up into the second parlor or the piano room. Here you can find reading material, a Keurig coffee maker, and a few candies to stave off hunger in the afternoon. Joanne is meticulous about the cleanliness, care, and design of this home, which is a labor of love for her. A fine display of uranium glass glows under the black light in the china in the second parlor, and a book sits on the table below for guests to sign. Every morning, the dining room table is beautifully set. Depending on the season, great care is taken with each tablecloth, placemat, place setting, dinnerware, and glassware. A decorative napkin ring secures cloth napkins for a picture-perfect table. Breakfast, which is included, can be anything from French toast and bacon to eggs with pepper sausage and a side of avocado stuffed with queso and salsa. Bob, owner and resident chef, is sensitive to each guest's needs and will accommodate allergies and food sensitivities. A large fresh fruit cup is served first with a glass of juice and your choice of coffee or tea. Our last meal included crustless quiche, a gluten-free blueberry muffin, and bacon that we could smell cooking from our room above. The first floor suite, Rochelle's room, is perfect for those who may have trouble navigating stairs. Originally, this room served as Michael Cahill's office. This room features a converted gaslight fixture and beautiful cherry wood trim, giving the room a sense of warmth. The bathroom includes a shower and all the necessary amenities, including my favorite white fluffy towels that you will find in all of the bathrooms in this bed and breakfast. There are small black hand towels for makeup removal and a wide selection of toiletries. Spoil yourself by placing your towel in the towel warmer for that special luxury spa feeling. Climbing the stairs to the second floor, you will see photos of the Dolan family that were found in the house and moose antlers that belonged to a physician from Ashtabula who shot the moose while hunting in Wyoming. After he passed, the antlers were offered to the B&B, finding a home once again in Ashtabula. At the top of the stairs on your right is the antique Rose's room, outfitted with a queen bed. This room includes a huge bathroom featuring a clawfoot tub in addition to a large shower. Once again, all of the toiletries are available as is the signature towel warmer. And this room features the ultimate luxury, heated floors. Across the hall, the canopy suite features a queen-size canopy bed and a private bathroom with a large shower and heated floor. And once again, all the niceties that make your stay comfortable, like the Mr. T shower gel, the signature fluffy towels, and a magnifying mirror that ladies will enjoy having for applying makeup. Tucked behind the entry door to this room is a beautiful vessel sink with a decorative brass winged faucet. 
one of the many elegant touches you will find in this home. The Garden View Suite, our favorite, is a large room featuring a luxurious queen bed with soft linens and an abundance of pillows. There are a couple of Queen Anne chairs, perfect for reading or relaxing. This room has one of the largest bathrooms we have ever had in a B&B. It has a modern glass enclosed shower and a separate soaking tub with a wooden tray to hold bath accessories or a book for relaxing and reading. There are lavender scented bath salts and even a rubber ducky to keep you company while you soak. The bathroom, like all of bathrooms, include an assortment of other extras like shower caps, shampoo, body wash, and scented bath salts for soaking. There is a sitting room on the second floor with plenty of natural light for reading and a beverage station for coffee and tea. If you lack reading materials, you can choose from a variety of books and magazines nestled throughout this room. In addition, there is a refrigerator for cold drinks and a small freezer stocked with individual scoops of ice cream and toppings for you to make a sundae treat, or you can use the ice cream and a mug to make a root beer float. The backyard features a pergola overlooking the garden and plenty of comfortable seating. This is a great spot for early morning reflections or a glass of wine in the evening. If you enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe to my channel. See you next time.